And finally, Horizon, an American saga. We're finally getting the first trailer out for the two-part Western spanning the four years of the Civil War. It's written, directed, and starring Kevin Costner. Here's a look at it. This epic direction is going to amaze you. The movie Horizon will leave the audience spellbound from start to finish. But is it worth the hype? Stick with us to learn more about it. Here we go. Recently, the much-anticipated first trailer for Kevin Costner's epic western story, Horizon, an American saga, defied all predictions. It tells a vast, epic story against the stunning backdrop of the American West, making it evocative of traditional epics. The images are amazing, perfectly encapsulating the spirit of the Wild West through exquisite cinematography. It looks like a return to the epic western genre, reminiscent of Taylor Sheridan's critically praised series 1883. Horizon seems to be ready to create a cinematic masterpiece under Costner's direction, bringing back the classic charm of the Wild West in a way that hasn't been seen in a long time. Kevin Costner's exit from Yellowstone, in which he had a pivotal role, suggests that he is now more focused on his role in Horizon. Yellowstone was clearly in decline. Its story was stuck in a dark, nasty loop that was more akin to a soap opera than a western drama. So do you think Kevin Costner's forthcoming western epics will permanently alter the genre? With the release of the Taylor Sheridan cable drama Yellowstone in 2018, Kevin Costner triumphantly returned to the western genre. Following a difficult beginning, reruns and streaming helped the show gain popularity. This led to the creation of a franchise that included more conventional horse operas, like the critically praised prequel miniseries 1883. However, following almost five seasons of the neo-western, Costner has returned to the big screen, directing Horizon, an American saga, his most recent frontier story. With two distinct chapters coming out this summer, this feature film series seeks to revive the western epic in theaters. But what impact will Horizon have on the genre moving forward? And how will Costner's subsequent success or failure affect viewer interest? The western genre, which was once ubiquitous in all forms of entertainment, saw a comeback on television because of films directed by Taylor Sheridan, such as Yellowstone and 1883. Studios and networks were spurred to approve a multitude of new projects, ranging from miniseries like Justified to continuations like the Deadwood film. As a result of this rebirth, new projects like Joe Pickett and lawman Bass Reeves debuted, all riding the wave of public curiosity sparked by Kevin Costner's triumph on television. This comeback is indicative of a larger change in Hollywood, as people's preferences are no longer limited to specific genres. But there are also plenty of westerns on the big screen, with hits like Django Unchained and 310 to Yuma drawing large crowds. The goal of Costner's Horizon, an American saga, is to revive the epic western subgenre by merging contemporary narrative with the enduring charm of the American West. The genre's revival highlights the ongoing popularity of western narratives, both historical and modern, and it helps to shape the entertainment scene of the 21st century. At this point, you might be wondering about the casting of the movie. Do you have any expectations for the casting and the upcoming characters? According to the sources, the expansive ensemble cast of Horizon and American Saga features a diverse array of talent, including Sienna Miller, Sam Worthington, Jenna Malone, Owen Crow Shue, Tatanka Means, Ella Hunt, Tim Guinea, Danny Huston, Colin Cunningham, Scott Hayes, Tom Payne, Abby Lee, and many more. Kevin Costner's significant comeback to directing with Horizon and American Saga follows his critically lauded films, Open Range, and the seminal Dance with Wolves. Expectations are high for this epic western saga, which is slated for a two-part release, with the first arriving in theaters on June 28, 2024, and the second on August 16th of the same year. 
With its impressive ensemble and intriguing plot, Costner's skill as a director, along with the picture's potential box office success, are all contributing factors. Horizon has a good chance of winning both critical and popular praise, which would be a huge boost to the year's box office receipts. In addition, the news that Costner intends to make two more movies in the series, a tetralogy, brings an exciting new dimension to the project's storyline. All eyes are on Costner and his crew to provide an engaging and unforgettable Western experience that might have a long-lasting impact on the film industry, as spectators eagerly anticipate the unraveling of this massive cinematic venture. What do you think about this? On the other hand, this movie is said to be an ambitious Western project. Well, that's what makes it incredible, epic. Westerns are large-scale, contemplative narratives of the American West, especially the Old West, which allow the viewer the leeway as they accompany the characters through turbulent periods and locales. Both the good, the bad, and the ugly by Sergio Leone and the searchers by John Ford would be regarded as epics. For a very long time, there was, much there was much exaggeration in the allegations that Michael Camino's notorious but criminally undervalued epic Heaven's Gate had killed the Western. Kevin Costner's epic from 1990, Dancing with Wolves, demonstrates this taking home the Best Picture Oscar. Horizon has a point to prove, almost as if Costner's classic Western response to James Cameron's endless Avatar epics or the now serialized Marvel Cinematic Universe. With each movie in the trilogy expected to cost over $100 million, this is one of the most ambitious projects to date and the most innovative series of back-to-back -back Westerns ever produced. If Horizon is a hit, there will undoubtedly be a comeback to the genre. At this point, don't you think this could turn into incredible work? What does the American saga have in store for us next? Prominent film historian Dr. Andrew Patrick Nelson, chair of the University of Utah's Department of Film and Media Arts, believes that with the release of Horizon, an American saga, the future of the Western genre is in jeopardy. With a skeptical attitude, Nelson says that if the movie doesn't work for viewers, it might mean a dire future for big-budget westerns going forward, much as what happened after the disastrous Heaven's Gate hit decades ago. The failure of Horizon could be a major turning point in the history of western genre. Given Costner's singular talent for bringing the spirit of the Wild West to film, his departure from the role may create a significant gap in the business and raise concerns about who else has the charisma and creativity to revitalize the genre. While viewers wait for the verdict on Horizon, the movie's box office performance may have a significant impact on how Western filmmaking is shaped going forward. Do you think this movie will bring up a new genre? Dr. Andrew Patrick Nelson and screenwriter Matthew Chernov discussed their thoughts on the three-minute teaser for Horizon in a recent episode of their podcast, How the West Was Cast. Nelson, a film historian and the chair of the University of Utah's Department of Cinema and Media Arts, emphasized how crucial it would be for Horizon to succeed or fail in order to determine how Western cinema will develop in the future. Nelson stressed that if Horizon had a good run, it might trigger a Western film industry comeback not seen since the early 1990s. But he also issued a warning, saying that if the movie doesn't connect with viewers, the genre might return to its previous status as a niche industry. Nelson concluded that despite the Western genre's ongoing appeal, Hollywood might be discouraged from pursuing comparable films in the future if audiences reject Costner's trilogy of historical epics. Therefore, even while the Westerns won't go out of style, studios might think twice before approving expensive movies set in the Old West, even if they star actors like Kevin Costner. What do you think about this upcoming movie? If you like this video, give it a thumbs up. If you would like more updates on movies, subscribe to our channel. Don't forget to click the bell icon so you don't miss any future videos from us. Don't hesitate to give your suggestions for our videos in the comments below. Until next time.